Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Infinite Fusion Season 2. I'm your host, Masu Unchained Awesome. And today, we mourn, with mournful hearts, we mourn the loss of our good Sarah Flame. She was a good little flame. She was a good little Sarah. We're gonna miss her. She was the best. <laughs> I'm not crying. <laughs> oh my god fucking <laughs> this is the most terrifying Meryl that's ever existed okay where am I going obviously we gotta go down this way I guess obviously right that rat beep <laughs> that rat beeper Unmasu, Unsam, you Sam. Tried to. or killed my good friend and longtime pal. Is this not back into the fucking. I'm so confused. Do I have to go this way? And we gotta teach. Uh. Flash to someone again. I'm gonna see if I can teach it to Elmi. Or I guess we can just teach it to Seraphlame. Oh! I hope we have a TM for Psychic! I guess we could just relearn it. I did not want to do that. Okay. I swear. Okay, no, this seems right. Okay. This is new. If I encounter one more Stantler. I'm gonna look. I thought it was a Stantler. <laughs> uh, okay. Unbelievable! <laughs> I can't believe they gave Stantler an evolution. Like, I can't believe they gave Stantler an evolution and it's better than the fucking Dunsparce evolution. Like, how did they fuck up Dunsparce's evolution that bad, man? If people, if you, if you were watching this now and you loved the Duns, the Dunsparce, I'm so happy for you. I really, I'm glad. I hope that you have a wonderful life. If you're upset about the Dunsparce, hit that like button, <laughs> or just hit that like button if you feel like it. I don't really care, but it does tell me if you enjoy things. Uh, but. Man, I just, I felt like Dundun Sparse was just such a missed opportunity. It was a funny meme for like two seconds, but it's such a missed opportunity. Do we seriously, I don't know if we have anything that like automatically breaks rocks, but like, I like, this is something that blows my mind. And again, I love this, I love this fucking game to bits. I love this fucking fan game to bits, but like, was it not a consensus that everybody fucking hated T HMs? Like, why do we, st why did you make this a thing? Like, have it that, like, we beat gyms and get HM abilities, not like, like, why, okay, so we didn't need to go that way. Maybe that's, maybe that's on me, but I'm just like, why are there so much HMs in this game that are still in use? Like, why have we not all collectively been like, no, no, we don't need HMs in fan games anymore. Was that the whole point of fan games? I don't know. You know me. I love complaining about things. I didn't even realize that there was a thing down here. Ah. I also never really liked the flash mechanic. Well, let's talk about things we like. Like, being able to fuse. Let's be, let's be more positive. This game has a speed-up button. Not a lot of fan games have speed-up buttons, I feel. Uh, the balancing of the game is actually pretty good, I think. Like, I think that this game never has you grind too much. Unless you're doing some kind of run where if you lose Pokemon like mine, like, I have to do a lot of grinding off screen sometimes because I lost a mon like Seraphlame. <laughs> but uh I think 
I think overall they their balancing for the game is pretty good. Especially for a game where you confuse any Pokemon, they still make it interesting. They also have a modern mode, apparently. I, I've never tried this before, but a modern mode changes up some of the gym leaders and allows you... like So, like, makes Brock a Steel-type gym leader? I think that's super cool. Luxray. Luxray is such a badass mon. Yo, speaking of badass mons, I got a Lilligant Sitting Cutie plush because we talked about plushes in one of the episodes. Masu, we need to turn back now. I rushed to the summit in, in my haste to see what was up there. But the thing I saw, it was beyond anything I could imagine. I thought we were prepared to take it on, but we're not. Not even close. This thing's power is unnatural. Just approaching it made my body tremble uncontrollably in fear. I had no choice but to turn back immediately, Masu. I'm sorry, but this expedition is over. We'll make our... We'll have to make our way back down now. I'm serious, Masu. Whatever it is, whatever is out there is too dangerous. I cannot let you go any further. I don't. I don't care. I'm sorry. I don't care. I. I let's back up. Let's back up. I'm sorry. I don't. I, I'll go down. I'll go down. I'm sorry. Uh, fighting ground type. I guess we'll switch to Scarboy because he's the thickest of the bunch. My team's gonna be like level a hundred by the time we uh get anywhere i did not no 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 no. please stop jesus i almost wish that wasn't a feature though that's a very nice feature in games giving us the option to just dip if we think we're not going to be able to take it on oh i almost forfeited this at the end would probably kicked me all the way back to the bottom and i would have cried cried literal tears literal irl tears even Sin the uh Oh yeah, counter doesn't even affect me. <laughs> I forgot, I'm a ghost type. <laughs> I was like, we gotta be careful of that. It doesn't even affect me. Bulbator. Oh. Uh confused right? Stone Edge. It's grass rock, right? Oh, big hit. Might not be rock type. Might be grass dark then. No, ground. It doesn't become a dark type until it's Tyranitar, which I always forget. Uh, okay. Gastata. Ghastly Rattata. Another... Ooh, Dark Poles. I was going to say another ghost uh, normal type. Just like me. Don't flinch me again, nerd. I dare you. Cool. <laughs> Scarboy is literally the team. Scar if Scarboy had knees, they would be crumbling with carrying them. Nido Wudo. <laughs> That's actually a fire name. Uh, this is Rock Poison. Stone Edge miss. Okay, I'm gonna go for, I'm gonna go for the body slam, but it's probably not gonna do that much. It did less, I think. Pseudo Wudo is a pretty cool mon, honestly. Let's go, baby. I don't mind Pseudo Wudo. It's shiny is pretty cool too. Electar. This is feel this is, I feel like is something Cynthia would just have on her team. Uh we're gonna confuse Ray it. Oof, that did quite a bit, but it was a crit, that's why. So this thing could be dark type. I think it is dark type. I think it's electric dark, if I had to predict. So that's actually scary for me. Well, that's only if it has electric type moves. Sets up electric terrain. I don't think I've ever dealt with terrain in this game up until this point. Tries to set up electric terrain again. Gets body slammed. Doesn't resist it, so he is a dark type. 
That's non-stab, and it's another crit. It's got, like, super luck or something. I don't think super luck actually makes you crit more. I think it just makes crits do better. Um, there he goes. He hits himself in confusion. Crunch might kill. No, it does not. It does barely anything. I'm surprised she hasn't healed any of her Pokemon. Snapped out of confusion. Tried to set up electric terrain for the fourth time and goes out. It just must have not had any moves for me, really. It's no use. I suppose you have already made up your mind. There's nothing else I can do to convince you. So be it. Let me at least make sure that your Pokemon are fully healed before you head out. Seraphlame, you're alive! I'm just kidding. I'm putting her at the bottom so I remember that she's dead. Uh, I'm going to switch Ramroar to the front. Against the legendary. Ooh. Actually, I should have saved just in case. I am going to save just in case. Your limbs suddenly feel extremely heavy as you approach the unknown Pokemon. <laughs> oh, I, I was stupid. I'm like, is there a red fight in this game? I'm literally red. Are you starting to feel... You're starting to feel extremely dizzy. I'm scared, actually. They're really building up to this Pokemon. Your vision is suddenly getting blurry. Is this going to be a triple fusion between Garatina and Palkia and Dialga? You feel as if you're being transported through time and space. Because it's definitely Dialga and Palkia, it, but is it going to have Garatina as well? As Masu was sent three years into the future. Uh... No! I am not ready for this fight, but this is fire. I don't remember this at all. If this happened, I don't remember this at all. This is cool as hell. I'm not ready for this fight at all. Uh, Good setup for me, though. Hurricane. We eat that. And we KO, four times super effective, stab, flamethrower. Dobuzz. Electabuzz. Something. Dobuzz. Dodrio, Electabuzz? I'll just switch into Ramroar. Dodrio, Doduo, Electabuzz? Yeah, Doduo, Electabuzz. I feel like I was probably supposed to do the gym rematch or the elite forward match before this, but I wish I could stack shell bell on leftovers, but that would be broken. You know what else is broken? Wasting my damn time with these potions. I should have just, I should uh, shadow sneak it, but now he's going to paralyze me, isn't he? Okay, no. Dobuzz goes down. Learned nasty plot. Probably over smog. Prinwag, so Prinplup, Poliwag, two water types. I really don't have an answer to water types. But it's also a Prinplup Poliwag, so... Like, there's not much to answer. Don't KO there. Okay, we're doing pretty good. Ratferno. Monferno Raticate? That would be normal fighting or normal fire. Um. Okay, we'll send in Ramroar, Surf or Waterfall, and then we'll see. Radicta. Okay. And Monferno. Yeah. Okay. 
That's really cool, actually. I really like the eyes on that one. I love that style of eyes, like the that style of Pokemon eyes, like Bulbasaur's eyes. I love those. I mean, I love all the Pokemon, like, designs, but just that eye. Rhypeer King. Definitely. Ooh, it's slacking. I thought it was going to be something else. Is a berry that protects him from water type moves? Yes. Mega Horn. Okay, we eat that i'm gonna heal in hopes that he has true want oh he swaps out interesting to buy toys uh water steel or water dark rock smash coming in handy barely did anything but lowered his defense sword stance he doesn't have guts or anything i don't think so he just has a flame orb that cuts his attack guillotine Oh, I don't think that can kill because we're the same level. Oof. That was kind of scary. Cool. Ram Roar takes it. Learn Heat Wave. You feel like you're being transported through time and space once again. I feel like maybe we did do this fight in the in the previous game, but I don't I don't remember it. Huh. Masu! Oh my, you're here! Cynthia said that the legendary Pokemon on Mount Silver made you vanish out of thin air! You've been gone for days! We all thought we had lost you! I'm so glad that you're all safe and sound! Cynthia had to go back to her home region, but she left us something. If you'd like to have it... Oh! Shiny Charm! That's really cool. I'm not sure what it does, but it sure looks valuable. By the way, that Pokemon that warped you out of existence is still up there on Mount Silver, is it? I know that I cannot stop you from going back, but please be extra careful if you do. Fuck, man. That's a that's crazy. I think what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna go look at some of the Pokemon that we're gonna replace Seraph Seraphlame. Though so not many Pokemon can really replace Seraphlame. And then we'll go do the the Elite Four rematches. And I'll grind up Frame and Centris so that they're at least decent for the the Elite Four, because I don't want to just wall it with Scarboy, but they've been kind of too low to do anything. We're going to give Sarah Flame her send-off. This is our starter. We met our Vol Volcarona in, um, in the Pokemon Tower, and now she's laid to rest. We will take her Shell Bell. <sighs> Sarah Flame, thank you for becoming a champion with us and for being with us this long. I'm sorry it had to end like this, but you were a real Pokemon champ. These are, these are let's go through all of our lost Pokemon cuz we might lose even more in the rematches, but let's look at our lost Pokemon. We lost Skittles, our Sentret, the first one we ever lost. Megabat, I don't even remember how we lost you. Sally Clops was here for a minute. Grayton was also here for a minute. We lost them in Celadon or Cerulean City. I think we also lost the Baki in Cerulean City. We lost Chomps. Lisa was the thing that Lisa killed something, didn't? Or Lisa killed Chomps, didn't she? And then she died. Quinnock, we caught. Uh, we caught that drag. The uh. Is that Quinn? I think so. We caught the Dragonair in... Yeah, because Croc. We caught the Dragonair in Cer Cer Cerulean City again, fishing. Baby, our second fusion, I think. Or our first fusion, our, our like second Pokemon that we caught in the game, I think. Squillium was here for a while, an egg that we got. Litten, actually crazy technician. Mew, we barely got to use it. Little Mac was actually kind of hype the entire game. Super, very, very cool Pokemon. One of the goats, Slodeon, our flyer. 
dies. Tebby also wasn't here for very long, but was very cool. Gagund was low-key. The Goat, very sad to see him go. Kroku also just got taken out. Jocelyn, I think we lost because I was stupid. Our only shiny we've ever got in this game. Chokus just died way before his time. And Seraphlame, one of the OGs, passes on. Now, there's got to be a, qu a question has to be raised. Does Neptune, Seraphlame's adopted son, take on the mantle? Do we bring another fairy type into the battle slash psychic type? Do we have Ophelia join in? Do we get another dragon type? Obviously, there's got to be something to be said about Ali joining. This is a regular Garchomp. Don't let the thing confuse you. We have Drake, Benny, Junior Seagal, Brock Tilda, John Cena, Sugar. I'm feeling like Ali... <sighs> we don't have an answer to water types, really. A grass type could be nice. Because this is Dark Ghost... This is Fire Ghost. We have a lot of weaknesses to Dark as well. Yeah, literally all of these guys are weak to Dark. Scarboy is a little bit less of an issue because he'll basically kill anything. But these are all weak to Dark. So maybe something that resists Dark type. Like a Fighting type maybe. Or a Dark type in its of itself, which would be the Tyranitar. Um, a Fighting type here, which is... Blaziken. We could go for Balloon, being an electric type. And then we also need to think about fun things. Or we have Rotter, which is already an elect uh, electrode. These two are grass types, over easy. And I think that's weed. Yeah, weed and over easy. We also have a flower here. We separate oils. Uh, a Meganium would not be bad either. Meganium is pretty cool. Tree Stars. I'm really tempted to get Neptune up to a Gardevoir. Because I don't know if we can get it to a Gallade. Because we don't have a Dawnstone. But I also don't want to add another type like that. I'm honestly leaning into uh, Meganium Tyranitar, but I don't know how cool that would be. We also do... I did... This actually... John Cena and Tyranitar might be amazing. Hmm. I'm going to level up Ali one time, and then I'm going to fuse them. So I'm going to cut. I'm going to try to level up Ali once. So, so we get the evolution of Tyranitar. And then actually... Well, we have a Link Cord. So we can up, up evolve Machoke with a Link Cord. And I'll be right back. And we'll see that fusion. Because I think that fusion might be actually really cool. Alright. We have a newly evolved Tyranitar. Now, let's see... Okay, let's grab some Tyranitar candidates, as you would say. John Cena. Nice to see you, buddy. It's very rare that we do. Okay. Also, let's link cord up John Cena. So he grows a couple extra pairs of arms. Couple pairs, just a pair of arms. Um, and then we're going to fuse. The Ace Blazer, I saw it. We're going to see. Ooh, okay. I'm thinking that might be it. I'm going to save that one till the end. We're going to see. Oh, <gasps> that one also might look rad, though. Wait. That one does. I mean, don't even... Okay. Tree Stars. Tree Star and Alley fuse. This might look sick. That's not as cool as I thought, but pretty dope. I do really like that. Um, confirm. 
keep Tyranitar's moveset. Okay, we're gonna defuse him. And then I think this one's gonna be the one. So let me turn off the speed up. I think this one will be the one. Fighting Dark type, which is what we wanted. Oh, come on, be cool. Come on, be cool. Ugh. I don't want to discredit anyone's artwork. The face kills it for me. Everything else is mwah, magnificent. The face absolutely kills it for me. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to do that one either. Back to the drawing board. Okay. I'm so sorry to whoever made these two fusions. I think the Meganium one was really cool, just not necessarily one that i want right now but it might be it might be the one that i choose uh nickname tree star nickname john cena okay i'm honestly thinking that maybe a gyarados could be a cool fusion too Haxorus could just, for fun, why not? I'm not just got another dragon on the team. Dark dragon, sure. That's never been an issue before. Um, Garchomp could be cool, too. Uh, Fairy could be cool, actually. Um, yeah, we don't really have... Nine tails could be... I still almost said nine fox. Nine tails could be cool. Let's see. Come on. Give me something good. Ooh. So dark water or rock water? I don't know if I would want to do rock water because that gives us a three times weakness to grass. I wish it gave me the flying type. That one also isn't actually bad. That one's pretty cool. Not a, Again, not a huge fan of the face. It's just really big. But... It's not the worst, honestly. I did not want to combine movesets. I wish instead of it saying, please choose the move, say, do you want to fuse the... Like, do you want to learn this move? Not a, you're learning this move. Just because if I accidentally press it... Okay, I think we're out now. Yeah, we're out of DNA Splicer, so let's go grab some by the store. Do I have a store here? I think it's this, right? DNA splicers. Let's get eight. Okay, Tyranitar. No. Uh. Tyranitar and Ophelia. That looks like it could be crazy. Dark Dragon, four times weak to fairy. That looks like it could be crazy. That is ridiculous. What? That's that's the one. I don't even remember how I spelt Ophelia on this one. We're gonna just have to wing it. Uh, I think I want Sandstream. No, I want Moldbreaker. Attack up, special defense down. Combine move sets. Dragon Dance? Yes, please. Taunt? No. Also, it it has Ophelia's name, so that's good. <coughs> we'll do Payback. Dragon Pulse over Payback. Sword Dance? We have Dragon Dance already. That's that's the one. That Ophelia is the one. Ophelia and Allie combined? Okay. Pokemon, so I did, let me write this down, because I know immediately once I click this, I'm going to forget it, Ophelia, I know I misspelled it so bad, okay, rename Ophelia, so it's Ophelia, 
So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So let's take off. I like the Leah for the ending. And then it's Ali. So Alia. I like that fusion name. That's crazy, dude. Alia's looking literally like Godzilla. Like literally like a Godzilla monster. This thing's ridiculous. This attack stat is ridiculous. If it gets hit by one fairy move, it's dead. But it's it's ridiculous looking. Okay. Um. Let's get the rest of the team in here. Probably not gonna bring in um. Scarboy because Scarboy is really high level right now. But I'm gonna farm and try to grind up these guys. I'll try not to get them too high level. And then probably in the next episode, uh, we'll do the rematches for the Elite Four. So thank you guys so much for watching. The next episode might be the last for this season. If there's anything else you want to see in this game, please let me know down below in the comments. If you want me to go after all the legendary... Oh my god, sorry, I got some burps. If you guys want me to see every legendary, feel free to comment. If you guys don't want to, well, this will be it, guys. See you guys for the next episode, or the episode. The next episode might be split up into two parts, depending on how long the fights go, but they probably won't go that long. See you guys there. Bye!